Hello, I'm Loredana and today I'll present you the new Pipeline Remix integration. Pipeline is a visual editor for smart agents. We have been working on a new and improved version of Pipeline that features visual smart contract creation and now we're making it available to you through Remix by using their plugin API. For this demo we are using the Remix Alpha version linked in the video description and if we go to the settings tab we can see the Pipeline button here. Click to load. You can find details about the project, link to GitHub and Gitter for questions and issues, and video tutorials. Keep in mind that Pipeline is work in progress and it's not suited for production. If we click Next, we can see all the functions from the contracts loaded from the Pipeline database that are deployed on the testnet that we are on, in this case, Coven. We can use these to mix and match and create our contract, but for this demo we will use the JavaScript VM environment. For this, we need to also deploy the contract here if we want to test the contract created through Pipeline. So we have to load the contract sources in Remix, compile and deploy them and then reload them in Pipeline. We can load the contract source in Remix by clicking this button. And we can see the new contract here. We do the same with each contract that we would like to use. We then compile the contract and deploy it here. We copy the address and we can see that pipeline already registered the compilation. So we just paste this, click this button and pipeline will load it in this tree on the right. We do the same with the other contracts. We now have our functions ready and we can move to the next step, but let's maximize the window. We can see the user doc and dev doc details for each function of the contract. And now we can choose the functions that match. And the idea here is to connect services from already deployed contracts in a new personal contract. In the future, we will also have support for various code patterns as shown in a previous video of our initial prototype. So we have chosen three functions and we can go to the next step so we can see the new contract solidity source changing on the fly when we make changes. So what we do now is connect the outputs of the functions to the inputs of other functions where the type matches. For example, we have this vendor output which is an address. If we click it we can see in green all the inputs that would accept this address type. So we connect it to the other vendor inputs. Then we have this quantity output from calculate quantity and we can connect it to the quantity from the buy function in the marketplace contract. We can see this product ID input repeated here, and this should be the same. So we connect this output to the other ones. And this is our final graph. The flow is, we want to automatically buy a product from the marketplace contract. So this new pipeline contract will choose a vendor from the vendor registration contract based on a product ID and the criteria in the contract. And then the vendor prices contract will calculate the quantity of the product based on the product ID, the chosen vendor, and the amount of ether that we sent to the contract. Finally, we can buy the product from the marketplace. From Pipeline, we can load the contract back to Remix and deploy it there. We can get the deployment arguments from here. We copy them. And we load this new contract to Remix. We 
we can minimize this. This is the created contract. We compile it. We paste the arguments that we've copied from pipeline and then deploy it. Before making this transaction, we can go to the marketplace contract and check how much quantity we have for the product with ID 1, and it is 1000. So for a product of ID 1, this is the ether value that we will send, and this is the buyer address. And we put the same ether value here. We make the transaction. And if we check this, we see that we also have some logs here, which is uh, the event from the marketplace contract in the buy function. And if we check the quantity again, we see that it's now 900. So we have successfully bought the product with ID 1. Thank you for watching. Have fun playing with Pipeline and make sure you see our other demos.